This is TQ playing Pathologic 2. I am currently about to organize my items because I think I have some time to go herb hunting before um, stuff goes down on midnight. Not 100% sure though. So we'll see. Well, this will definitely help us. That will just make herbs spit out of the ground. Now I'm going to do this. I know. Wait, no. No! Don't be a butt game. There we go. Well, I don't know what. Just. And I'm saving this stuff. So. I guess I'll go towards the children's stash because it's getting late and then I'll have to go to the theater. But first, I have to save because. Oh my goodness. Now, yes, okay. Just looking at how I want to do things. Because this game, you don't want to waste walking time. I could take a, um, a ride, but I'm not super pressed for time. And as I walk past things, I'll be able to listen for, um, tw and look for Twire. And you gotta have those herbs. Can't make potions to save people with them. So. Whoopsies. There we go. One moment. Okay. There's something on my screen and it was really starting to irritate me. <laughs> so. Definitely go through here because sometimes this really is the best time to look for herbs because they glow. And yes, there are clues. I've already checked that today. I'm not going to check it for the 500th time. Um, there are sound clues. Like one of the herbs actually sounds like a rattlesnake. Um, oh, the, that's not what I want to do. Of an egg. So five, and what is this? Nah, I'll save it for now. And you, kid. <sighs> Do I want more feet? <sighs> yeah, I'll do that for some more morphine. Oh, I'm respected now. That's more than I could say for <laughs> how it was like early in the game. Hello, creepy blonde child. Yeah, I can get to there through this way. Oh, there went a cat. And not one of mine. That was a pretend cat. <laughs> I think I have to climb up some stairs to this. Because, you know, there's supposed to be a cache right here. And honestly, if I was to make it huntable, I'd make people climb up here. That's just me. And honestly, it's kind of thing where it's like, ha ha. To coward, you know, claiming somebody's a coward if they don't, aren't willing to come up. Hmm, no. You know, I've been wondering about these towers, and I think they're like early attempts at the polyhedron. I mean, maybe that's obvious. But to me, I'm like, huh. <sighs> so my first instinct with something like that is just to jump down because I don't like that noise. Oh, that's what it was. Poor blood. Did 
Today was a turning point. Fates are decided at midnight. If you want to protect someone, take care of them before nightfall. A new pantomime is being rehearsed in the theater. Affected over the past 24 hours, 343 people gone missing, 36. Well, I wasn't even warned for that. Oh, come on. <sighs> I guess. The day is over. The end draws ever closer. A new pantomime is rehearsed at the theater. They go away because oh, here it is. Schmouter! Dusting up. Found the last walnut hidden at the tadpole yard. Meet you there. Fun. Take the chestnut now. What will I leave for the children? Children like weird stuff. Here. I'm gonna do that. Kids will probably appreciate that. I'm gonna split them. Put one of those in there too. Wait a minute. <gasps> I'm in an affected area. That's why I, all that noise is coming up. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Thanks. <sighs> I'll use that one right now. Now I'm gonna run out of here because I've been just fucking around. An idiot. I think the other way would have been quicker, but I'm not sure. Oh, my immunity's going down, but it's not at such a rate that I'm fine yet. Yeah, I can't. I have to. No, I can't jump like that. This was not the surprise I wanted. I should have known better though. Should have known better. Oh, sure. Kids are doing something, of course they are. There we go. Some water will help. <laughs> Don't know what's going on over there, but um. Let's put that away from now. Not very happy because I feel like I've wasted a bullet, but at the same time, he's off me. This game is so I'm already starving again. <sighs> Wait, is this the right direction? No, not for where I want to go. Well, I can go around, I guess. <sighs> can I? Go to the kids first, I guess.
Oh. I guess I died for the first time. For real. Ah, you're a jerk. To climb out of the pot, you'll have to burn your hands. Is it my line now? Oh yes, you're right. Here I go. Go back, my friend. The door is over there. How did I get here? Oh no, no. Wrong line. Let's try it again. I was dead. I was dead? And then, death is never quick. Understanding is a process. Unpleasant, but unavoidable. What is but a moment for an external observer might feel like a day inside, or a week, or if you're particularly unlucky, a year. No, I'm not dead yet. As a director of our theater, I will now inform you of the most important pillar of your role. Silence in the audience. So, with each death of a new actor, we all face irreversible consequences, got it? Irreversible. Irreversible? Are you unfamiliar with the world? The world you are acting in changes with each <laughs> stage death of our hero forever. Even if we had a chance to trick time, go back and start over from... A turning point, the consequences of death would remain. I'm not an actor. I'm a doctor. You seem to have me confused with someone. Bravo. Great job. Keep up the demeanor. What demeanor? Any actor who continues Barack's path in place of the previous Barack will have it harder than their predecessor. Such is the theater of cruelty. Each death makes the role harder. You will become burdened with consequences of your prejudice predecessors' deaths, their negligence. What sort of consequences? Unpleasant and painful. You won't be able to make a step without a drink of water. How's that? What about being unable to touch a close one or growing as weak as a five-year-old child? Your life force has already dwindled, and it'll keep dwindling with each co consequent death, each and every one of them. This is absurd. I warned you, each new attempt will be harder. When one actor dies, the next one finds themselves even closer to the abyss. Try to finish this piece in one go, you personally, so that no one has to replace you. Have pity on your successor. I'll touch clocks more often from now on. Forewarned, forearmed. Didn't I make it clear that, it, that clocks won't help you? A clock is just a point from which a successor begins. And they still carry the predecessor's mistakes. Else we never saw the riddle. Riddle. What riddle? I'll explain it to your successors. If you fail, clearly those will be beyond help anyway. Those third-rate phonies so I'll have to spell everything out to them. Wonderful. You're a dangerous man, Mark Immortel. Is that a last name or a nickname, by the way? So, yeah. That, that means we die. <sighs> now, let's see where it brings us up. I think I'll actually have to go back before hunger. Yeah. Thoughts M on the medicine things. Oh. No. Okay. Oh. I'm going to change what I have to do here, because I learned my lesson. I'm going straight to the theater. <sighs> the stars are out. I think is that... I don't know which one that is. I've already looted there. I'm a dummy. Got my stamina build. 
This area is generally safe-ish because... Unless the plague is here, because generally nobody's here except for Grief. And Grief, well, he doesn't care. <laughs> make me nervous too. Actually those are probably cats. <sighs> I think I'm going to the grocery. I don't think I want to put myself at too much risk. Good one. I think I'll buy fish. Buy two fish while I can. Because money is not going to stay good. I use a fish. There we go. My hunger is so much better. I think my health bar is smaller too for now. Yeah, see, this yellow means my health bar will never grow bigger than that again. Trade. Oh, crud, I just remembered that one thing had a schmouter, and I'm not going to get it back. Oh, well. Kind of glad that even though I died, I've not officially wasted bullets. Oh, unfortunately, though, when you die, what was I gonna say? Um, even though I'll have the rerolls, they'll still be infected, cause you know, who cares what's good for me? So, no, I'm not. Almost at the top. Oh, that's the thing. I think I'm gonna leave for a bit. I'm like, hmm, that's dangerous. I'm not reading that over. But I did protect the crude sprawl from infection. Nobody can take that away from me. Death toll 26 people. That's not fair, by the way. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that's gonna be how it is. The day then. is over. The end draws ever closer. A new pantomime is rehearsed to the theater. Let's see this pantomime. Uh-oh. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the outbreak. 
The theater is officially disbanded. As well as other conveniences. Running water, access to your own children, who never leave their beloved polyhedron anyway. Sewage, friendly smiles on the street, any respect for the institution of marriage, food, etc., etc. On the order of that big city bachelor, all theatrical costumes are to be handed out to orderlies. You know, protection. By the way, obeying the orderlies is now mandatory, per current laws. Is that all? For now. The town is doomed. Why bother with any of this? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, please focus on your life aspirations. You have little more than a week now. Make sure your affairs are in order, and do your best to pursue your dismal dreams. Thanks, jerks. Oh, those two are such butts. So, oh, thank you for putting the dead item shop there. Huh, it didn't show up today. I wonder why. I'm not going there, but I will go to the dead item shop. It's gonna be more dangerous there, though. Fun. Okay. But what is my health anyway? Eh, it could be a lot better. <laughs> Let's be real. Backbone. Okay, this area is usually safe until later in the game. Because that's what the law is. <sighs> what do you have for me, dude? Bullets. Oh, I have to go around, I think. Yes. You know, you gotta. Alright. Yeah, this area is going to be affected now. Things. What is my immunities reasonable enough? But I better move to the side because this little bastard. By little, I mean big bastard. The chine is infected. This place is what they call burned, which means there will be more undesirables about. You grow gloomier every each each uh, gloomier each day, fellow traveler. Did something happen? Gee, I wonder. Look how nice and peaceful it is around. People pass on, but things remain. Lots to do. Did you find a lot of items? People are different. And all hoarders, too. One needs a keen eye to tell the things they need from the things they don't. So people get attached to junk that should have been discarded in the first place. No one ever gives away anything voluntarily. That much is true. Alright. That's six. Those are worth six. Oh. oh, that would be a nice thing. They sell really well. I think I would definitely want one of those. <sighs> Let's see what these. Yes. Two. <sighs> Anything worth two more? Yes. I can get another 
bullet. So I'm getting a fish and a pocket watch, which will be great for selling later. Fish over here. Fingernail over here. Uh, the game seemed so much ha seemed so much happier earlier now. All right, went to the dead item shop. I think I'm gonna take the boatman there. Yeah. That'll be the fastest way to get to my friends. I'm respected. Woo. I'm gonna stack that properly. I'm gonna look. Okay. Lots of direction to go. Looks mostly safe here, but... Uh-oh. I hate lag. You can do a game. Oh boy. I like being in dangerous areas and my game not wanting to respond. He saw me. I've damaged him before. Well, I'm getting tired, but I think I can do this still. <sighs> I wonder what that fire is. Or is that my friends? Give me. Oh, that must be my friends. See if there's any stuff around here. Yes. Dogs are howling. Why? Because they're dogs. We've been talking while we we're waiting for you. What you talk about? Isn't it obvious? Any old grudge is pale in comparison to this sort of catastrophe. <sighs> Tragedies like this bring people together. Ought to, anyway. So it did to us. I disagree. The outbreak will sow discord. It will tear apart friends and families. It wasn't the plague that got us together. It was you. You don't have to. No, it was all you, your will. You've done really well, Cub. You swallowed your pride and the wrongs done to you. You weren't ashamed to vouch for grief. I don't think I could have done the same. Last hug before the flood comes? We'll protect each other and we'll try to survive, yes. We'll try. By the way, do you know why all the stations were shut down? Both cargo and passenger stations. Has it been long? The passenger station was shut down a year ago. Cargo only recently in the summer. There's some sort of renewal project. Remember how enthusiastic they were about building new railroads before the war? Were you also there in the front? Served as a medic for a while. Nothing interesting. What do you know of this disease? They're calling it sand pest. Do you know why? I know nothing except there's an outbreak before. What about your father? Has he left any notes? Three scribbled pages, some drawings on the walls? No, nothing. I mowed down every one in the port district last time, no survivors. Every single person got infected. Every single person died. Does this mean there's no hope? Perhaps there isn't. So what? The most important things inside us need not rely on hope. 
Hope you don't mean the internal organs. It's good that you still have a sense of humor. Oh. And the rain. The goddamn rain. Does it ever end? Pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring. I think I should go. I have a lot of work to do. I didn't expect you to come. Neither did I, but I don't regret it. I've regained my strength a bit. This place, it's good. It's all we've, I've already forgotten what this step is like. What's that train car over there? I don't remember it before. Damned if I know. I think someone lives there. A kid, maybe. I saw a ball on, there on the rails. Kids often gather around these parts. Not everyone is fond of that polyhedron. Not everybody fits there. Got a key? Uh, nope, not everyone fits. You mean they're filtering someone out? I don't know. I have no idea how to deal with children never had. Even when you were one yourself. Uh, forget it. I don't chatter. Yes, I'm angry with you, and you ought to understand why. It's not anger, pal. It's jealousy. Let go of it, will you? It's ridiculous. What does the L say? Hell. Oh. oh. My lips are cracked. The wench has us all over a barrel. Nothing to be done about it now. A murder of crows, huh? There weren't so many crows in town before, were there? Nope, it was all sparrows before and larks. A fair share of starlings. Scared, aren't you, brother? Huh? What will you do with the cutthroats? What can I even do? Pretend I'm still their leader to their face and then disown them? Polite society? Already on it. What else is there? <laughs> oh, you dork. It's up to you, pal, but it, you won't last long. Not this way. Thanks for sharing your opinion. Now shove it up your ass. Calm down. It's too late for me, cub. I've only got one road ahead of me now. Perhaps the outbreak is for the best. Plagues are li like fires. People forget old scores. All hell will break loose so here soon. Any dark prophecies to share? You're the criminal mastermind here, after all. No need to prophesize. People fear hunger. Even honest workers will turn their hatchets and hammers to crime. Burgling housing, losing corpses, gutting each other. They will. Oh, they will. Not all of them, Grief. Not all. The turf's so dry you don't even need a match. A glare would start a fire. And when the kin bears its teeth, that's when we'll all dance. They're slow on the start, but oh so fast on the draw. The master likes them mute and obedient, but apathy makes them way that way, not stupidity. They're only obedient till the time comes, and here it comes. Big words. And the people who lose their jobs, they won't be too fond of staying home. They'll find new hobbies, like looking for food or venting their anger. And Fat Flod shut his facilities down the day before yesterday. Didn't he? Crafty. Didn't whisper so much as a single word to me. Do you think he knew? <sighs> Who knows? If it's the same sand pest we saw five years ago, we're all finished. There was no salvation from it. Every single person in the crude sprawl died. Your father was fast enough to lock the doors back then, so it died there. Only reason we're still alive. Now we can't even lock the gate, and there's no one to lock it either. He made a hard choice. Perhaps if he had more time, he could have found a better solution. That doctor's quick on the draw. Already shot someone. So much for his oath. One, um, three, you four. You aren't cub anymore, Burach. Time to grow up. You're such a jerk sometimes. <sighs> I'm 
Well, I'm hungry now. Oh, yay. I think I get something if I stay here till dawn, so... Definitely gonna eat a fish. Look at that hunger disintegrate. And... Got some water, so I can jerk that up. That's over there, that's over there. Yeah, I don't know when they say. Var the usurer wages war on all poorer. Just nailed barley down. Here we go, all around. You're so weird, dude. This takes as long as I think. You aren't I'll... cub anymore, Burach. Time to grow up. And I mean... stays quiet. Has his finger in the pie, I'm sure. Yeah, well, that's what he does. What do you have to say, Cranky? <sighs> You're all cranky. Like, grief's the best, I guess. Oh, wow, you can really see I the poly you can here. Yeah, I'll probably... No, no, no. Stop, stop. Whoa, don't have room for that, do I? Shoot, shoot, shoot. Put that there. Can I pick it up now? No. hungry again. Mother freaker. <sighs> Sometimes you're just hungry, I guess. I'll go a little more around here. I'm just here for the waiting for an achievement. <sighs> I couldn't go to the guy and do that. That's why that thing didn't happen. Okay. Oh, I think at the when when it switches to the next day, officially I'll. Day four, which the theater observes. A full house. Shit, I didn't even get it because I walked too far away. <sighs> that was my fault. So, I hope you guys had fun. I messed up an achievement, so guess that's life. <laughs> See you.
See you guys later. Toodaloo, take care. I don't know. That's what somebody else says. Um, I guess what I'm going to say is have a good one. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm messing this up wrong. Okay. This has been Pathologic 2 with TQ, and I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Goodbye.